Okay, Eve, I'm just going to put these on. Because this is no longer the future for health in aged care. As this nursing student is discovering in this simulated consultation, it's happening now. Can you feel any pain when I press Not here? There. No. In a real remote assessment, a doctor would be seeing and hearing this through this headset. And with training, the wearer can also access virtual records and monitor vital signs in real time. It's the first time student nurse Heidi Burrell has used this system. Very exciting. Definitely you've got the knowledge from a doctor literally like next to you. At La Trobe University's Digital Innovation Hub, they are putting the HoloLens headset through its paces. Okay, Jeff, we're just going to pop this on your finger and get a few readings for us. No, that's good. The numbers are coming through great. Thank you. Remote exams in Victoria exploded during COVID, and up to 400 patients are seen by the state's virtual emergency department every day. Now, this new technology is about to be trialled in aged care. We are really bringing our eyes into the consultation. So we are there with the nurse, seeing what they're seeing, hearing what they're hearing. And no known allergies. Remote examinations are already common in aged care, but they can be awkward, with a nurse struggling to hold an iPad or phone, and sometimes a second staff member is needed to assist. I've told her about your sore neck. Oh, yeah. In many aged care residences, freeing up a second worker isn't easy. With augmented reality and with a headset, that would be a better system, I think, maybe in the future. The plan is in the coming months, this technology will move from the lab to testing in the real world. Norman Hermont, ABC News.